Hello to everyone from Read Speak Upload. I am here to express my opinions about the great novel of uh, Sleepy Hollow, which was written by the amazing author Washington Irving. So basically, the Sleepy Hollow tells us the story of a schoolmaster named Ichabod Crane and the things he goes through in the small town, such as how he falls in love, how he gets a rival, and well, sadly, how he gets chased down by the so-called Headless Horseman. Now, was it really the Headless Horseman that chased him down? Of course not. Turns out it was just his rival, Brom Van Brunt, who dressed up as the Headless Horseman to scare Ichabod away. Kinda sad for Ichabod, right? Well, it seems like an average story, huh? Well, here's a fun fact. There is actually an argument that is about what nation's literature the story belongs to. Some say American, some say British. I personally believe that it's American since at the time Washington Irving was writing the story, there was an independence war in America against Britain, by the way. So obviously this leads me to believe that uh, Washington Irving has expressed his national thoughts and uh, opinions and emotions onto his novels. So. The novel may get its comments, but there are actually around three movies of this novel. But I am talking about the one which was directed by Tim Burton, which was produced in 1999, and which had Johnny Depp starring in it. Now, the movie and the novel may share the same name, however, they don't share the same plot. The movie's plot is far more complicated, but can we really blame Tim Burton for changing it? To be honest, a movie that involved all the accurate information of the uh, original novel would be a little bit bland and boring. But somehow, the movie manages to catch the atmosphere that the novel gives us, so I definitely recommend it. Although it might take a while to actually understand the whole plot of the movie, so I also recommend watching that a few times. Oh, well, it seems like we're running out of time. Thank you for listening to me. I hope you enjoyed. Bye!